Hello again, folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms. I'm your host, the Gamer Darius. Last we left off, we went through the sand tunnel in order to get to the ship graveyard, which is actually a town by the name of Yard. Yard, that's the name of it. And in order to make some progress, we have to go to the Pleasing Gardens, which are an illusionary maze somewhere located in this desert. Uh, not going to do that just yet. I want to head back to the Sand River and um, see whether or not there was anything in that last section that I missed. Now rest assured, if there is not something that I missed, uh, then I will simply be cutting out this part. That's about it. In which case you might just miss a level up or two, but you know, seeing as I'm saying this stuff now, you probably have some eyes that, hey, I found something. Eh? Eh? Whoop. Is this a one-way trip? Oh, hi. There's writing on it, but I can't make it out. Because it's too dark. Some sort of writing is becoming visible in the flame. In battle, the most important thing you have is your mind. Keep a stable mind, relax your breathing, and your body will do the rest. Basically, it means to calm down. I'll try, but fast draw hint acquired. Cool. I am suddenly rather glad that I came this way. Apples. <laughs> I'm back at square one. One moment, folks. Okay, hear me out for a second. I just thought of something really stupid. But based off... Oh, hey. But based off of what it is that Rudy does... Oh, what is this? Something Blade has been mastered. I didn't see what it did. Dang it. <coughs> Point is, based on what Rudy does, if you were to piece it off of, you know, 3.5 Dungeons and Dragons and Skull Frost and whatnot, he's a spellcaster. Just a stupid thought that I had while I was moving around here. Anyways, Heal Blade. Oh! It's like a self med it's like a meditation thing, I get it. That's actually pretty wicked. Alright, anyways, I'm nearly out of this place. I'm just... Just wanted to make th sh make that uh, thought shared and stupid and whatnot. Although, I guess if we were to put it to 5th edition rules of how... Uh, spellcasters work and whatnot, he'd be a warlock. Just saying. Ah, murder. Murder, murder, murder away. I'm gonna head back to the town of Yard anyways. You guys missed a grand total of like three minutes of me completely missing everything. Trying to run away. And uh, failing. That's always fun. Ding ding. Dun 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 dun. Rudy's gone up. He's now level 19. Don't want. I don't think that there was anything else in this area. The heel blade, though, is just fantastic now that I think about it. It's a little bit more expensive than. I was about to call her Nina. It's a little bit more expensive than, um, Cecilia's heel when she can actually get it. Excuse you, I was not pressing down. I was pressing up and to the right. That wasn't weird at all. I don't know what you're talking about. Reload ammo. I'm gonna buy everyone their armor first before proceeding into the desert. 
That just seems like a smart idea. Now, where was that armor shop? There it is. Yeah, armor. Boncho. A chic bolero. I'm not even sure what a bolero looks like. And no one gets a sword. So that when the people get a sword, it becomes a massive upgrade. Anyways, that killed a good five minutes of the video, so why don't we actually try to get into the deserts? Sound good? Sound good. Da da da. Da da da. Now I've already proved myself wrong about the one-way trip thing when it comes to... Oh, and a little bit more. Yeah, there we go. When it comes to the description of my last video. <laughs> Hello. Oh. Alright then. Oh, this will be a thing. Illusionary castles with sand scissors. Better trickster them just in case. Sand scissors. Are they immune or are they weak against frost? Potion berries. Oh, that's fantastic. That is stupid good. Oh, they look adorable. They don't even do all that much damage. Yeah, potion berries are the ones that heal for a thousand HP, which at our level is... Mwah, delicious. Alright. Uh, something something illusion. I already forgot what that girl was saying. Something something illusion. Uh not sure what else. Maybe I gotta go right and then around the left? I don't know. I do know that they keep on attacking Cecilia, which is a little annoying. Eener. 700 or 600 XP though. Not bad experience. Huh. Wait, is this back wall that I'm facing against right now? Oh, those are basilisks. Not sure how much I want to let them have a chance to live. That's nothing. Eh. Okay, that got literally no one. Good. Mm. Basilisks, much like cockatrice, uh, are creatures that are known to be able to petrify you. So I guess in this game, petrification is the same thing as stunning you. No. Oh, it was right and back. Okay. Oh boy. Ooh. Treasure. I better be able to get that. Ooh. Raulos. Don't know what those are, but I hope they're not immune to fire. They look like shadowy dogs. Eat salves. 
Okay. None that useful to me right now, but... I say until I get the heat status. If there is some sort of heat status, I forget what it was that it, um, heals. Point is... Other way. Whoop. That was weird. Audio glitching. Yay. More cockatrice. Boo. I'm gonna trickster and then freeze one of these. Scissor guys. Because potion berries are good. Uh, in the meantime, screw this chicken in particular. Boom! <laughs> Zero armor attack? I'm gonna guess that does more damage depending on how much armor that particular character has. There's probably cheaper ways to be getting myself berries, but eh. Well, with push, with uh, heal berries being so cheap. Being able to get some potion berries for emergency situations. What was this one? Right, max HP to all, as well as status. Hello. Did I want to hit this? I don't think I wanted to, to hit this. I did not. I see how this is gonna go, game. I'm displeased with how it's gonna go. That time will me back to the beginning. Alright. That's... Fine. Just gives me more opportunities to use Trickster on your goddamn scorpions. That way I can steal from the potion berries. <sighs> and no, I'm not really worried about MP when it comes to Jack. Like, one carrot will do the job of healing him completely, after all. Oh, right. I should have used the other thing with Cecilia. And if push comp really comes to shove, and I'm low on HP, I'll just use that Ambrosia. 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 Anyways. Alright. So this way... I have one of these... As well. Oh! One of those was a door. Uh, way to the north. I'm gonna murder these chickens. Murder them. Murder them before getting stunned, please. They are alarmingly fast. I say alarmingly because being able to go faster than Jack is not good. Yeah, that pathway. Oh, I nearly missed that. Uh, what was it doing? Apples. Yeah. Party apple, give to Rudy. Power apple, Jack. Nah. It's a save point, too. I want to be able to hit get whatever the hell's in those boxes to the left of this chamber, so. Mm -hmm. 
Not this way, this way is not the way I need to go. This is fine. More trickster. Freeze it. These guys aren't that bad. They really aren't. Like, they might get one attack off. Can't kill them in one hit. Which is good, because I want to be able to steal from them. I also had set up Trickster, or not Trickster, set up Freeze to be the attack that Cecilia does primarily because it's got a relatively fast animation compared to Flame. So, unless a creature is particularly weak against Flame, how the hell am I supposed to open those? All these hellish hound thingies. I don't want to trickster them. Boom. Critical. Oh, they actually do a fair amount of damage. See, my idea of running down that way was that I was possibly going to run into another uh, arcway that might have been secretly the way that I need to go for like a switch or something. Okay. This is as they say not the case. Really kill that chicken. Chicken. Oh, for once I can steal. That sucks. Kind of wish we could get a closer up shot of these basilisks' faces. I just want to see how reptilian it is compared compared to actually being like chicken-like it is. You know. Couldn't steal, what the hell? It's like the lower my MP, the lower chance of it actually succeeding. That's probably not the case. Alright. So if there's a button up in this pass... Hmm. Oh no. Uh... Oh, I see where this is gonna go. I'm gonna get a grappling hook or something like that. Ah, oh, come on. The worst thing you could do is throw me a freaking group of enemies and they can't be all targeted with one mass attack. Dang it. I think these things have a higher magic defense than most enemies. Because her attacks do power body steal? Oh, it's a absorption ability. Yeah, please don't do that. More heat cells, yay! Alright, so what's this way? Ooh, got a feeling this is gonna get confusing real quick. Hi, Ant Lion, it's been a while since we've seen you. Wonder how much damage I can do to it. Okay. Oh, that's annoying. That's really annoying. Doom. Freeze. 
freeze, please. Stop spamming heal. There we go. Now you're dead. Hmm. Okay. Oh, the button. That was the button. Ah, oh, more cockatrices. Actually, nah. I pro it probably won't happen. I was thinking to myself, maybe I should wait until Cecilia gets a force so that she can use her mystic ability. But I don't think that's gonna happen before the end of this combat, especially now that I've used Rudy's baboon shot. Yes, Rudy's baboon shot. If I waited one more round, maybe? That's a big maybe. Yeah, nothing that way. Um, okay, this means I'm going back for those chests. You. I got a bullet clip. I got a bullet clip. You know what? Valkyrie. Haha, uh -huh, you wasted your heal. Seldom get a good opportunity to use that against a singular foe. It's expensive, but worth it. Nope. Frick. I think if I want that treasure chest, I want a, a duplicator key. Awesome. I want If I want that treasure chest, I have to go the wrong way. Balls. Balls, I say. Oh, he didn't heal for once. Which kind of makes it so as this Valkyrie does way more damage than it should. I really should spam that against bosses, shouldn't I? Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, that's not alarming in the slightest. go that way anyways. But never mind. Does that at least lead me... Nope. Just give me a little bit of a round robin. Gonna see what needs to be. I think I might hit this chest, hit the save point, and call an episode soon, though. And I don't need to do that. <sighs> One of these fights, though, I gotta spend it just to use mystic abilities in order to fully heal and get magic and whatnot. Stop attacking me. Bad Poochie. Or whatever the hell you're supposed to be. K. 
Okay. Crests. Two crest grafts. You know what? I'll happily accept those. Also because I have to, because I just picked them up. Ugh, cockatrice. Sorry, not cockatrice. Freaking basilisks. Oh man, yeah, those are more reptilian faces. Now that I got a good look at it. Counter attack. Cool. Only one chicken to deal with. Deceased. Alright. Well, I'm gonna hit this save point and then I'm gonna call an episode. When we return, there's a teleportation puzzle ahead of us. I'm none too plussed about this, but hey. It's a little bit of variation from the running around and killing most of monsters and existing sort of a thing. So thank you everyone so very much for watching. Uh, hope you guys are enjoying this series as much as I'm enjoying playing it. And I keep on bumping my microphone because it's in a new position. I apologize. As always, hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care. Cheers.